Hi, my name is Arjuna Ditham and I am a bioengineering major at UC Berkeley. I research the bacterial cell wall, specifically a layer called peptidoglycan and its role in bacterial infection. Peptidoglycan is an integral constituent to the bacterial cell wall. It mainly helps the bacterium from rupturing uh, in a variety of different environments, ranging from broth conditions to when a bacteria is actually trying to infect a host cell. And because peptidoglycan is actually unique to bacteria and is important for bacterial cell viability, it has become a major pharmaceutical drug target. Structurally speaking, peptidoglycan is a collection of polymer strands that are cross-linked or chemically bonded to each other to form a rigid mesh that surrounds the bacterial cell. If we look further into the uh, peptidoglycan, its subunit or monomer consists of two sugar molecules which form the backbone with the tail of amino acids which actually mediate the cross-linking. In order to visualize peptidoglycan dynamics in cells, a strategy to label newly synthesized peptidoglycan was developed. It was found that cell machinery responsible for peptidoglycan synthesis could actually incorporate artificial amino acid reporters into the peptide tail. This artificial amino acid reporter, shown in yellow, is special because it contains what we call a bioorthogonal reactive group. This group is biologically inert, but in the presence of its partner, quickly and selectively reacts. This allowed molecules such as fluorophores, symbolized by the green star, to be covalently linked to newly synthesized peptidoglycan, and cells could subsequently be imaged for further analysis. My project extends on this technology in order to make artificial crosslinks. This works by incorporating complementary amino acid reporters onto different peptide strands of peptidoglycan and then cross-reacting them in order to form artificial crosslinks. Doing this in bacteria that are unable to make their own crosslinks can actually help answer some questions regarding the role of peptidoglycan crosslinking in infection. For example, does peptidoglycan crosslinking purely prevent cell rupture or interestingly, since peptidoglycan stiffness can be modulated by crosslinks, is there an interface between the mechanical properties of peptidoglycan and the biological response seen in bacteria? I expect my research project to help uncover previously unknown host pathogen interactions, which can hopefully culminate in new drug targets. Such inquiry is especially important given the current expense of many drugs that are currently on the market, in addition to the fact that many drug treatment regimens are extremely, extremely cumbersome for people to follow. Importantly, many pathogens, including mycobacterium tuberculosis, which causes TB infections, are actually developing uh, drug resistance to current pharmaceuticals that are on the market. This project aims to interface across chemistry, biology, and bioengineering in order to not only help expand our current drug repertoire, but to also improve global public health. I wish to thank my research advisors, Professor Bertozzi and Dr. Segrist over at the College of Chemistry, Funding Resources, HHMI, NIH, and ACS, and you for your attention.